Bom dia, good afternoon, good evening guys, wherever you are on this beautiful world, whenever you're watching this video, welcome to the Bitcoin Family YouTube channel. For the newcomers, my name is Didi Tahutu, and yes, I am the guy that four years ago, together with his family, sold literally everything he owned, went all into Bitcoin and started traveling the world. Four years later, guys, still traveling the world, coming to you from Lagos in Portugal in today's video of course bombing you with really cool bitcoin charts because we just saw a huge dip in bitcoin and i don't want you to freak out but i want you to zoom out of course also sharing the result of the dd bam bam indicator and in the blockchain slash news part guys we are going to take a look at circle we are going to take a look at gold how much outflow there has been in gold and how much inflow there has been in bitcoin i'm going to show you the preview of my avatar in blockchain valley virtual so it will be a cool video with a lot of info and a lot of cool charts. Enjoy the video, guys. Bam! I think it becomes time to go make my video because they are getting their five crazy minutes. You see? <laughs> I don't think that couch is for running. Don't care. I don't care. I have beautiful hair. <laughs> She's tired. She's already tired of jacket. Yes. <laughs> okay. Stand on normal. I know. Jess is going to overtake you now. Oh, now you know why. <laughs> Let's first start with the Bitcoin part. The part where I bump you to a really cool charge. Bam. The first thing I want to talk to you about is that yes, we just saw a dip or a correction in Bitcoin. We fell from $19,000 to around $17,500 US dollar. That is a huge drop, but it's a drop that is part of this huge bull run. Like you can see on this chart, bam, very quickly, because I already showed this chart many times, you can see the last bull run, the previous bull run 2015 to 2017, we had 200% runs. 30% corrections, 40% corrections. This is part of the game. Always zoom out, never freak out. If you're invested in Bitcoin, don't freak out, zoom out and just understand the four year cycle that we are running through. And yes, just understand that we are just onboarding this rocket to the moon. That will be the new all time high 2021 December. Because if you look at this chart, bam, you can see that we can even reach 50K around already in May and we can even reach 300K at the end of 2021 like this chart is showing you. It is all possibilities. I'm not saying that we are going there, but if we would repeat history, the numbers that we have seen before this bull run, then we could reach those levels next year. And if you believe in the plan B charts, then take a look at this chart. Bam, because on this chart, you can see that the November red dot appeared above all the other red dots, just like it should. Yes, we are on track if it is up to the plan B chart to 100K next year 2021. Because this red dot was created around 19,700 US dollar, which is higher than the previous red dot. Every red dot is a month. And like you can see in the previous bull run, you can see the red dots stacking up before this huge bull run will start and then your dots will change from color and then you know that we will be accelerating in the bitcoin bull run and to be clear i believe in this stock to flow model and yes i can see a 100,000 us dollar bitcoin price somewhere in the end of next year yes i believe this stock to flow model so instead of freaking out i would zoom out and dollar cost average into bitcoin if you see bitcoin dipping don't start to freak out start to buy little by bit add more bitcoins to your portfolio because if we would follow the stock to flow model guys yes buying at 17,900 or 18,000 or 19,000 it doesn't matter if you buy in 2k more expensive because at the end we will see 50k or 100k what do those 2k matter then I don't think you need to freak out and need to stress on when to buy the dip, the perfect dip. Just dollar cost average into Bitcoin, guys. Buy the dip bit by bit. Referring, of course, to the bit of Adam Beck, because we don't talk about sets anymore. We are talking about bits by the bit. 
bit by bit. And that there will be many dips, you can see on this chart, bam, this is a dip chart. Yes, it is a normal chart, also again created by Charles BTC. Look to the top of the chart, you see this red area, these red uh, droppings, like this, the, this is the dips. So these red areas are representing the dips in 2015 to 2017, if you look to the left on the chart. So you can see there was a lot of red. That was every time there was a huge dip in Bitcoin, we saw this red. Now you look to today and you can see how much red we have today. There is less red than in the previous bull run. Yes, and that could mean that this institutional investments now are decreasing the dips. So we saw 40% dips in 2017 and 16. Maybe we'll only see 20% dips now in 2020 because there is so much institutional money coming into the market. So we don't know, but you can see on this chart that these dips are part of the game. So don't freak out, zoom out, and just enjoy the ride because it's a beautiful roller coaster ride that I refer to as Bitcoin. <laughs> For us, it has been a roller coaster ride, guys. I'm in this industry since 2012 13 when I started mining bitcoins. I had the first crash in 2014. I thought bitcoin was going to zero, it was never going to come back again. Then in 2016, I saw it going to 20k in 2017. I saw it falling back again in 2018 to 3k, in 2019 to 3k. Yes, so I know how volatile bitcoin is, but I also know how hard bitcoin can run out of nothing. You will not expect it, you will not believe it, just that you do, didn't believe or didn't expect Bitcoin to go from 9k now to 20k in the last couple of weeks. Nobody expected it and nobody believed it. Anticipating is always better than reacting, so that's why you buy the dips. Or, of course, you're a member of the DD Bam Bam indicator. So let's take a look at the Bam Bam indicator if that one saw that we were going to dip. Let's check this chart. Bam! If you look at this chart, you can indeed see that the Bam Bam indicator indicated this dip. Because you can see that these green hills and grass are turning into the yellow sand and the blue sea. That is the moment the bulls are leaving the grass fields and the bears take over because the bulls don't like the beach and the sea, they stay on the grass. That is also the same moment you can see this red flag appearing. All these green lines on the chart are showing you where we expected the market to go down. And then when you look to the bottom of this chart, you can see the DD Bam Bam indicator. There's this blue line crossing the green line. And then after that crossing the white line, that moment that we crossed the green line, went sideways a little bit and then crossed this white line, together with this sandy and blue sea area, and together with this short flag, there was a triple confirmation that we would need to take that short. On the next chart, you can see how we traded these signals yesterday. Bam! You can see we traded with 250 US dollar and we traded a couple of trades. I think we ended up with around 490 US dollar. So that is a 100% gain if you tra trade with 250 US dollar. The first trade guys was a short, it was 29% profit, 2.9% but we trade with a leverage of 10 so that was 29% and that brought us to 300 US dollar, somewhere around 300 US dollar. And after that guys we took a long, another short and another long, which in total brought the number to 390 US dollar. The fifth one guys, that again was a short, and that was a good short of 26% which brought the total to 490 US dollar. But again, this fifth short was not a perfect short because we used the training stop loss. And you can see this wick going down, this means we were kicked out there out of the trade at that point because yes, it went very long down and the trailing stop loss is following, 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 following. And then uh, suddenly this is a wick and we go pull back up. So then it hits my trailing stop loss. And that means that we are kicked out of the trade, but still it was a $100 profit just in that trade. So that's a really cool trade. In total, 100% profit from $250 to $490. Um, I think the BAM indicator, yes, can see and can give you an indication when these markets are turning around. When can you expect this drop? This is the 15 minute chart. You can also use it on the four hour chart or on the day chart. And then you would already been short 
since yesterday or the day before. If you want to know more, just join the Discord server because we share all the information there as well. And we share also how to join the Bam Bam Indicator. We share all the charts that we use in the videos there. So it's a really cool source of information, the Bitcoin family Discord server, where we are becoming a huge kick-ass Bitcoin family with over 800 members that all talk about Bitcoin, blockchain, and life. And also charts like this one. Bam! On this chart, you can see, for example, that we already shared today in the Discord server. Look, guys, don't freak out. Zoom out. Stay calm. Because look at the 27th of November, what happened over there. We saw the same movement, the same dip. We can see the BDD Bam Bam indicator indicating that again. And then we went beautifully up again. And now we can see the same. You can see it in the top squares, the top two squares. You can see and compare what is happening. And you can also in the bottom two squares see that the Bam Bam indicator is moving the same way. So yes, don't freak out, zoom out. We will go down, you buy the dip and we will go up. Or you long Bitcoin when this green flag on the DD Bam Bam indicator appears and you just long Bitcoin with a leverage FM and you take some more profits. And that is how you accumulate and multiply your Bitcoins. That is what you need to do. Multiply your current Bitcoin stack. And that's what you can do by trading or by doing other things in life that you earn Bitcoin. That is why we earn Bitcoins every day again. That were all the charts for today, guys. I hope you're able to zoom out now and not freak out. Let's jump into the blockchain slash news part, this part. Bam! We are always comparing Bitcoin to gold. So Bitcoin could be the 21st century gold. I still believe that this is possible because of these huge institutions now starting to invest in Bitcoin. So the market is changing from consumers like you and me that bought Bitcoin into institutional investors and huge trust funds. So yes, they can use Bitcoin as a digital gold. In the last four weeks, we could see an outflow of gold of 9.2 billion US dollar. I think that's a record outflow of gold out of the market. So people are selling their gold, more than 9.2 billion dollars in the last four weeks. In the opposite, 1.4 billion US dollar flowed into Bitcoin in those, same, in those same last four weeks. So can we conclude that the people that sell their gold use a part of their profits to flow to invest it in Bitcoin. So can we conclude this? I think we can. I think a part of the sales of those people that are selling their gold are investing now in Bitcoin. And I know guys that if we zoom out that Bitcoin cannot compare with gold yet, but that is positive if it's up to me. Because in total this year 4.8 billion US dollar flowed into Bitcoin products and all these trust funds and everything. But at the same time, guys, this is only 10.5% or something like this of the 45.7 billion US dollar that flowed into gold this year, in gold products this year, and all those trust funds and everything. So that's only 10%. So Bitcoin is very small compared to gold. But that is positive. This shows me a huge growth potential. So if now more and more people will understand the power of Bitcoin, that are used to the power of gold, the traditional strong store of value gold. And if those intelligent investors, intelligent trust fund managers start to understand and believe the power of Bitcoin and have the tools to start to accumulate Bitcoin, maybe they will diversify, not 10% into Bitcoin, but maybe next time they will diversify an extra 10, so maybe they will take 20% of the gold stack and put 20% into the Bitcoin stack. They also see that Bitcoin is getting less volatile and less risky and way more KYC verified all that shit. So they start to trust Bitcoin as a new digital gold. And they are in this business to make money. They just want to have more more and more. And if they can see that Bitcoin is outperforming gold every time again, every year again, they will slowly start to diversify, I think, their gold hodls into the Bitcoin hodls. And that will add up to all these huge Bitcoin funds and Grayscale and MicroStrategy and all the billionaires already are buying Bitcoin every day. So yes, I think there is a huge, huge, huge growth potential for Bitcoin in the next couple of years. So yes, 
Don't freak out, zoom out, have all these stories in your mind. When you see the price dropping, just smile, go to the beach, go to the bar, wherever you want, drink a Bacardi Coke, zoom out, have fun with your family. And the next day, when Bitcoin goes up again, you look at the charts and you start to smile again. That is how it works. <laughs> that is how you try to control your emotions. If you see these dips, close the computer, leave the screen, go and do something fun. The Circle CEO just announced yesterday in this interview, guys, in the future, I think hundreds of millions, maybe even billions of people will be using cryptocurrency. If, if Facebook will go through with the DM, with the DIM, with the DM, with the DM, how do you, uh, how do you pronounce it? You cannot comment below with a voice message, can you? Is there already a social media where you can respond with voice messages? Hmm, I don't know, but, um, hundreds of millions of people are going to use cryptocurrencies daily. And I completely agree with him, guys. Money will evolve. Money has always been evolving. We started with stones and beans, and we went into silver and gold, and then we went into coins, and then we went into paper notes, and then we went into plastic cards, you know, credit cards, bank cards. Then we went into internet money, like PayPal and all these uh, options. And now we are going to evolve again, the next step into cryptocurrencies. This is the evolution of money. And the next step in the evolution of money will be cryptocurrencies. And Bitcoin is one of those. And yes, Bitcoin can be a peer-to-peer -peer cash. And yes, can be a store of value. It doesn't matter. It was the start of an evolution of money, of a revolution we have not never experienced before, of a social economic shift we have never experienced before. That is why Bitcoin is so big. That is why I have a Bitcoin tattoo on my arm, because I believe it is a revolution of the monetary system that is bringing the power back to the people instead of to the centralized organizations that have been running our lives and our finances in a way that I really don't like. I think in five till 10 years time, guys, everybody will say, how could we ever use paper bills of different colors and give the same paper with a different color another value? How could we have been using this in this time that we already were so advanced with technology because of internet? That, will, that is what we will say in five years time. I think in 10 years time, the kids that will be born if my kids get children, you need to take them to a museum to show them coins and paper notes. Because in 10 years time, I don't believe we will ever use coins and paper bills anymore. You can take your kids to a museum and there show them behind the glass, look, this is how we cavemen paid with stones. And then we evolved and we started to pay with golden coins. And then we evolved and we started to pay with plastic cards. And then there was internet and we evolved to using PayPal, but in all these periods, kids, we were still using also paper money and coins, yes. Then there was something really beautiful that was uh, invented by Satoshi Nakamoto, whoever it is, and that was called cryptocurrency, and that was changing the whole world. And yes, we had a revolution. And kids, listen, you will now never be able anymore to use those paper notes and to use those coins, because we do everything digital now, with our iPhone, with our, with our watch, with our whatever lens. I don't know how we will evolve, but I know we are going to abandon physical cash, guys. We are going to see digital peer-to-peer -peer cash all over the world, central banks, central governments, they will all do this, guys. And we are going to see this no matter what. This is going to change. And 10 years time, kids won't even understand anymore what change means, because you will never get change back because you will always be paying the correct number. <laughs> the bill is this, you scan it, and you pay the correct number. There is no change in the, in the future anymore. Why would you change, you know? Can you imagine? Oh no, I will pay with one Bitcoin and then you get the rest in change? No, you will pay exact amount that you need to pay. This is already a huge shift in the monetary system, guys, and it's going to be bigger in the next 10 years. And that is what I think, guys. And you know, I am just a dude walking in nature with a hollow cap, some bitcoins. So don't take everything for granted that I say, but this is my vision. This is my YouTube channel and I share my vision. If you want to be on the YouTube channel and if you want to take a role in this YouTube video for, of me or in the YouTube channel or like you want to have a comment or you want to have a shout out, then use your family tokens. Go to my role rewards page 
the Bitcoin Family Reward page, and there you can buy a reward. And one of the rewards is that I can talk about a subject in YouTube that you want, or I can use your music below the video, or I can do, you can buy all cool rewards on the Try Roll reward page of the Bitcoin family. Now we should jump into the Bitcoin family part, but today I'm doing something different, but let's jump into the next part. Bam! The next part, guys, will be my avatar that will be walking around in Blockchain Valley Virtual very soon. They are fully developing the whole world over there now. They are starting to develop uh, some avatars. Check my avatar, how I am going to look in Blockchain Valley Virtual. Yes, even with a tattoo. Check this 30 second clip and let me know down below the video if you like it. Bam! That was everything for today, guys. I hope you really enjoyed this video. Next Friday, again, a kick-ass family show at Gokstein Media. The last two shows are being viewed many of times, I think 12K or 15K times already. And they are really cool shows, just family stuff. No Bitcoin charts, no blockchain news, just how we live as a family. So make sure you watch those first two because Friday, the third is going to go live and you don't want to miss out on that one as well. That was everything for today, guys. I hope you really enjoyed the video. If you did enjoy the video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel, share with your friends and family, hit the notification bell, and please leave a comment as I love to respond to your comment. I want to thank you for watching today again. Always remember, guys, to zoom out in Bitcoin and to zoom in that life. Try to enjoy every single minute of the day as that is exactly what life is about. Thanks for watching today and hopefully see you tomorrow again. Bye.